Investors, one of the most important things a startup needs, but where do you find people that are willing to invest and how do they find you? Alessio, do you have any idea? Well, I co-founded Crowdfooding, uh, which is basically an equity-based crowdfunding platform that connects food entrepreneurs with investors. Um, our mission is basically to leverage you know, the disruptive power of the internet uh, to connect um, to, to, to facilitate the investment process. And we plan to, we're planning to do this uh, by basically helping food startups and investors make the best funding match. Um, and yeah, so that's, that's pretty much what, what, it, what Square Fooding is about. And why did you choose to focus on only food startups? Well, you know, there was a kind of a revolution happening uh, behind, you know, the whole food space. And, and we think that, you know, food startups are actually tackling, you know, some of the, the, the biggest issues that are affecting our food system by bringing to life, you know, um, products that are actually meaningful and, uh, and very innovative. So, um, on the other hand, we understand that there, there is a lack of, of knowledgeable investors in this space who are actually willing, you know, to invest in, behind these companies just because, you know, the, the dynamics of this, of this industry is, is slightly different, you know, compared to tech companies or, you know, any other, any other industry. So, uh, and also, you know, as capital intensive ventures, most of these companies, they will need additional capital even to create, you know, prototypes. So, um, they need, you know, knowledgeable investors on the one end and maybe more capital than other, uh, let's say, more traditional companies. Can you name a very uh, successful investment in a food startup? Can you oh, give sure, an example? Yeah. Sure, yeah. I mean, there are many, there are many examples that already happened, let's say, in the past. Um, one of the most remarkable ones is, is a company called Anton Creek, which is actually from San Francisco, uh, that was able to raise $120 million, uh, in funding in, uh, in five rounds uh, by, you know, um, from accredited investors or people in, the, in, the, in this industry because they're actually, you know, really changing kind of the games uh, of, you know, how they make actually mayonnaise without uh, eggs. So they, they're using actually data to create physical products. So uh, it's pretty, you know, innovative, let's say. Oh, mayonnaise without yes. eggs. Okay, okay. <laughs> if you guys want to know more on this or on uh, crowdfooding, go to crowdfooding.co. Thanks so much for joining us.